Bolivia, a country famous for its high mountains and football-loving president. Its Olympic Games history, though, is patchy at best. In 12 previous editions, the Andean nation has yet to secure a single medal. However, Claudia Baldarama is hoping to change that as she prepares at high altitude before taking on the best in the world in the 20-kilometer walk. Her personal best is 10 minutes slower than the world record, but the 29-year-old psychologist is still determined to do her country proud. Often we Bolivians say we are too poor to achieve anything. We need to change this mentality, get rid of this negativity and start saying I can. I want to continue working every day and over there in London I am going to go up against the best in the world and know that I too am capable. With me, Bolivia will have a presence in London. To boost her chances, she's joined the Mexican team and their coach Raul Gonzalez. High altitude training pushes the body to produce more red blood cells so that when the athletes return to sea level, they go faster. It isn't enough just to turn up. You have to work hard. The most important thing is to know how to train hard, because with the lack of oxygen comes physiological changes. These changes help when there is a drop in altitude. At sea level, results can improve by between 10 or 12 percent. Baldarama will need all the help that she can get if she's to have any hope against the favourites, such as defending and three times world champion Olga Kaniskina of Russia, and win a first ever Olympic medal for Bolivia.